Good morning. Expect more of the same with warm and dry conditions. We continue to track high pressure until next week. Here comes our next storm system. So this is Monday into Tuesday. Rain chances picking up for Central Texas, much higher farther to the north, but at least now we're going to have some changes and of course cooler air behind this storm system that'll be moving through. So until then, it's going to be really nice temperatures out there. In fact, look what we've had so far this month. We actually got up to 80 degrees yesterday in Central Texas, and I anticipate for the next four to five days, we're going to have some red boxes here across the board. So, so far, 80% of the month has been above normal and honestly no complaints because upper 70s in November we will definitely enjoy it while it's here. Tropics real quick. We've talked about Ada all week. It's now just left Belize. The center of circulation is back over the open water. So that means the storm will likely begin to intensify now back into a tropical storm. Here's the track goes up to Cuba and then it makes a turn back toward the west across the Florida Keys as a tropical storm still. But then look how the cone gets really wide. The models are still kind of haywire. I do think it's going to stay in the eastern part of the Gulf of Mexico, which would keep the impacts away from us. But in terms of how intense the storm is going to get, that is still a big question. So we'll still, of course, continue to watch that. For us today, as the kids are on the bus, it's 57 degrees this morning. Afternoon highs will be back in the middle to upper 70s. So another nice day again. And of course, Friday night lights can be really nice out there with temperatures falling into the 60s. For your highs today, it's 78 across Waco Temple, Colleen. We're in the low 50s tonight with our normal being about 50. So still a little bit above the average for this time of the year. And we'll start to cool those lows down, not until next week. So it's 52 tonight, 57 for uh, tomorrow morning, 61 Monday. And then look at that, we're up to the 80s with cooler weather and rain chances throughout next week.